A up and welcome to Callum's Corner. This video is going to be a little bit different to my usual ones. I'm trying a few different things on my channel, making a little bit more YouTube friendly content. Doesn't mean I won't be doing my little vlog still, I will be. I'm just doing some other ones as well. Um, a lot of you have been asking to talk about my childhood, you know, what was it like, kind of take me through it. And a few of you said you should do something like a draw my life. Um, now, I don't just want to do what other people have done on YouTube, I want to try and do my own thing as well. And also, I can't draw to save my life, so that's not going to work for me. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take you through my childhood, and I'm going to do it using theme tunes, which probably th sounds uh, kind of a bit weird to you. But music is such like an evocative thing, you know, you can hear a piece of music, and it has this power to kind of take you back to where you were and how you were feeling at that time. Um, I did consider doing like popular pop songs, you know, through my youth and stuff or books or something. But I'm going to go for theme tunes just because the music I listened to was rubbish back then. Um, and also theme tunes, it's, it is a piece of music and it's something that you heard so many times because you'd watched this. Well, I used to watch the same shows all the time, you know, same ones every week. So that's what I'm going to do anyway. It might be really boring. And if it is, I apologize and I won't do one of these again. If it's not, then awesome. So, I'm going to start with my youngest kind of memories of watching telly. Um, here's a little clip of it for you. Yeah, there you got it. It was Dog Tanyon and the Three Musketeers. Um, I'm sure none of you have heard of it. You have to be probably a lot older than most of you are to remember that. Um, yeah, it was obviously a kind of cartoon remake of the Three Musketeers. It was pretty rubbish, but I loved it when I was young. And the theme tune just brings it all back to me. Being kind of five years old in front of the telly, um, knowing that my dinner would be ready soon. Yeah, just really reminds me of being young. Moving on to my next one, it's when I was a little bit older. I was probably about eight or nine. Um, absolutely rubbish show. Um, would never watch it now. You guys don't know how lucky you are, really, having reruns of Friends and good stuff on all the time. It was four channels when I was young, and you had to watch some absolute rubbish. But the theme tune still, yeah, still makes me kind of want to wobble my head a little bit. So here you go. <laughs> As she wrote, there you go. Right, moving on swiftly um, to the next one. This is when I was a little bit older still. I was probably 10, 11. I was allowed to stay up a little bit later on a Friday night. Um, yeah, really, really reminds me of being young, this. Friday nights had a really kind of... Just remember them, particularly because my dad would always be away on a Friday night because he went. He was a driver, you know, he drove the buses, coaches and stuff. So he'd often be away on a Friday and me and my sisters and my mum would have what we used to call chocolate pub night where my mum would nip to the pub next door. They had a little off-licence attached to it and she'd buy different types of chocolates and we'd all share it out into different little bowls so everyone had a bit of everything. And yeah, then this would come on. I just felt really grown up watching it. So here you go. Sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name And they're always glad you came You want to be where you can see Our troubles are all the same You want to be where everybody knows your name yeah. Theme music to Cheers. Cheers. It was a really good show. Um, really catchy theme tune. I don't know why, it's even now when I listen to it, it makes me feel all these different things, you know, happy, familiar, a little bit sad and melancholy, you know, it makes me think of my dad when I'm missing him. I kind of, for some reason, um, think of the Cheers theme tune. I don't know why, because he wasn't there even when I was watching it, but I guess I was missing him when he was away working when I was a kid and stuff. Yeah, so there you go, Cheers, big part of my childhood. Okay, moving on to the next one. This is not a show that I watched um, weekly or anything. This is the theme tune to one of the greatest times in my life, actually. It was before my parents split up, not long before they split up. Um, it was when everything was good at home. And it was basically the best time for football that I've ever experienced. It wasn't long after Blackburn Rovers had won the league, which was already awesome. And yeah, here you go. Listen to this. Game. 
We're not creative enough. And we're not positive enough. It's coming home. Euro 96. It is the greatest tournament of my lifetime. If you're not old enough to have been kind of alive then or remember it, I really feel sorry for you. It was absolutely fantastic. It's when that song was first released, so it hadn't been around for years, and everyone, absolutely everyone loved it. Everyone was singing it. Every stadium rang out to it through the tournament. Um, it was in England, a tournament in England, and that was just incredible. Um, and actually, we were quite good as well. You know, we had a decent chance of winning it. We beat Pet Spain on penalties. We actually won a penalty shootout for once. We smashed Holland. Shearer was banging them in. Gascoigne was not in his prime, but he was still really good. And then we lost to Germany, as usual. But up until that point, there was more belief than there has ever been that we could win a tournament. You know, trust me on this. Everyone thought we could actually win it. And it's not been like that in a tournament since. You know, you're always hopeful that you might do well, but we actually believed that, you know, it seemed like we were going to win it. It seemed like it was destined. It was an incredible time. I've never seen England get into a tournament in the same way. I guess because it was held in England. Everyone was into it. Flags were everywhere. It was absolutely brilliant. It was one of the best times of my life, um, in terms of football anyway. And as I say, Blackburn Rovers had won the league before. Yeah, it was just a great time. Just absolutely brilliant. So that brings back really, really strong memories for me. So the last one I'm going to bring you is when it's going to fast forward a bit. Now, I was 21 here, so you can't. I can't really say it's my childhood, but it's when I consider my childhood ended, if that makes sense. Although I was already technically an adult for a couple of years. Um, it's when everything changed for me. So, yeah, I'm going to bring you this. go six feet under um bit of an unusual choice it's not normally my kind of cup of tea not the kind of usual thing that i would watch but it came at a time in my life as i say i was 21 and i say it was the end of my childhood because i'd started to kind of lose people for the first time i'd had my kind of first love and we'd broken up um and that always hits you hard i think although obviously you go on to meet other people it's never quite the same as that first time because you've yeah, that first one, you you think it will never end, I guess. And for every relationship after that, you know, it probably will. And also, my father had passed away not that long before. And Six Feet Under just seemed to kind of, I don't know, it was comforting. It's all about death and losing people and people dealing with that all the time. And for me, it was just, yeah, a really kind of cathartic program to watch. So there you go, my five theme tunes of my childhood. Probably a really, really boring video, and I apologise to you all. It feels like a boring video, so I'll probably not do it again. Um, maybe I won't. No, I will post it. I will post it and just give it a try, I guess. You've got to try new things to find what works, I guess.